Product reviews are an important part of any online store or marketplace. They contribute to social proof and buying decision. They generate more content for search engines. And they also give you another way to interact with your customers and gain valuable feedback. In this video, you'll see how customers submit and interact with product reviews and what you can do to make the most of them. When a customer is on the product page, he or she can submit a review. The review usually includes a product rating and a commentary, but it may also include separate description for advantages and disadvantages, as well as one or multiple images. Once the review is ready for submission, all we need is accept the terms and conditions. We can also choose to write the review anonymously, which is what I will do to demonstrate how it works. Click Submit Review, and it's done. Note that the review won't appear on the product page automatically. First, it needs to get approved by administration. That's where you come in. You'll see the notification about the review in the admin panel. Just click it, and you'll end up on the page of the review. Here you can edit the review, approve it, or even add your own reply if you want to comment on something. Let's do just that and click Save. The review will appear on the product page in all its glory, and if other customers find it useful, they can vote for it. As an administrator, you can change some things about how product reviews work. To do that, go to Add-ons Manage Add-ons, find the Product Reviews add-on, and click on its name. Here on the Settings tab, you can decide how many reviews customers see at once, whether reviews require approval, what information you need in the review, and who can leave those reviews. If you have separate storefronts for different countries and languages, you can also choose to separate your reviews by storefronts. We hope that this functionality helps your business. Product reviews, as described in this video, first appear in version 4.13.1. If you start with this version, you already have them by default. If you are upgrading from version 4.12 or earlier, which had less advanced product reviews, the process is pretty straightforward. After the upgrade, old reviews will still be located in the old comments and reviews add-on. It is okay to disable it, but keep it installed. That way, you can always go back to the old add-on without losing data. When you install the new product reviews add-on, you'll be offered to copy the data from it. The add-on settings will contain a new section which will allow you to copy the data. Just click the button and all the old reviews will be copied to the new add-on. There is a catch though. For a review to be copied, it needs to have a rating in stars and a commentary. A review that doesn't have one of these things won't be copied. If you want to transfer them, you'll need to add the rating and the commentary before you copy the reviews. If you ever need to copy product reviews again, either because some of the reviews didn't transfer or because you wanted to stick with the old comments and reviews for a while longer, just uninstall the new product reviews add-on. This will clear its data and once you reinstall it, you'll be able to import old reviews again. And that concludes this video. Do let us know what you think about this format in the comments. This was Ivan from the CSCart team. Thank you for watching and until next time.